Good day, everyone. Welcome to Teacher Jim's e-learning class. How are you today? I hope you're doing good. I hope you're fine, you're well. Okay, so this topic is for the higher per term level, grade four, grade five, and grade six. The topic is entitled transportation. And we will be discussing the different types of transportation, like the land transportation, air transportation, and water transportation. But before that, let's identify these transportations. Okay, let's start. Okay, let's study the structures. I have prepared three structures for you to practice, okay? First structure, what transportation is it? Can you read that? What transportation is it? The answer would be it's a or it's an blank. It's a bus. It's an airplane. Okay, that's the first question. Now, the second question, how do you go to blank so identify the place how do you go to school for example answer i go to school by van you identify the mode of transportation one more time how do you go to school another example how do you go to the market i go to the market by boat or by bicycle okay next question is blank a and blank transportation? Okay, let's have an example. Is bus a land transportation? Answer, yes it is or no it isn't. Look at the picture here. So we have the sample question. Is bus a land transportation? The answer, yes it is. Is an airplane a water transportation? Airplane, is it a water transportation? No, it isn't. All right, so those are the three structures for you to practice. Okay, let's continue. So what transportation is it? It's a car. It's a car. How do you go to school? I go to school by car, particularly your parents' car. Yes? Okay. Next. It's a van. It's a van. A van is a land transportation. I go to work by van. How do you go to work? I go to work by van. Is a van land transportation or is van a land transportation yes it is okay next we have taxi taxi this is a taxi i go to the market by taxi is taxi a land transportation Yes, it is. Okay, next. Sorry, let's go back. Okay, motorcycle. Motorcycle. Do you know how to drive a motorcycle? So mo a motorcycle is land transportation. I go to school by motorcycle. But be careful when driving. Okay, next. We have train train it is a train a train is a land transportation i go to kanchanaburi by train okay next picture we have subway subway okay so this is a subway okay a subway is a land transportation. Next, we have a truck. Truck, it's a truck. 
A truck is a land transportation. Okay, we have bicycle. I go to school by bicycle. I go to school by bicycle. It is a land transportation. Next, okay, category, the air transportation. We have an airplane. It is an airplane. Okay, when I want to go home to the Philippines, I fly an airplane or I ride an airplane. Airplane, it is an air transportation. Okay, next we have helicopter. It is a helicopter. A helicopter is an air transportation. Air transportation. We also have this one, hot air balloon. Hot air balloon. Okay. It is an air transportation. Okay. Now, we also have the water transportation. We also have the water transportation. What is it? It is a ship. A ship is bigger than a boat. Okay, one more time. Ship. It is a water transportation. How do you go to the market, for example? How do you go to the market? Maybe Talatnon. I go to the market by, wow, by ship. How do you go to Chiang Mai? Or how do you go to the Chao Praia River? Do you use ship? Or how do you sail? Okay, by ship. Okay, next, let's proceed to this picture. Boat. Boat. It is a boat. It is a water transportation. It is a water transportation boat. Okay. In Bangkok, there are uh, boats there for transportation. When you want to go to, to some stations in Bangkok, you can use the boat. You can ride a boat. Okay. Next, we have raft. Raft. It is a raft. It is a water transportation okay raft is usually used in reverse okay reverse one more time raft all right so these are all the types of transportation okay i want you to look at them so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11, 12, 13, 14. So 14 types of transportation. We have the land transportation, water transportation, and air transportation. So I want you to practice the structure, the three structures, and then I want you to answer your worksheet. So this is the end of our class. So for week two, I'll see you again for week three. See you, bye-bye. Thank you for studying.